Hey guys, what's up? My name's Hope. I'm a full-time nurse and a part-time reseller. I save lives, I save clothes, I save all the things. Thumbs up for that. Today I have a massive, massive bins haul. I spent $68. So yeah, I'm going to show you what $68 can get you at the bins. It is finally the time of year where I'm wearing my Christmas sweaters and sitting in front of my tree in my living room. My house is all decorated. I have started a new series on my channel, Hope at Home, in which I share all things home, decorating, lifestyle, yada yada. And I just did a video of my dining room, which I'll link up here. So if you're into home decor, holiday decor, all that stuff, be sure to check out that video. I got quite a variety. I'm sitting on my floor also with these giant bags in front of me. So my back will be dead by the end of this video. I got a whole bunch of different stuff. If you're new here, <laughs> I don't usually pick up kids stuff because I just don't find, I don't get excited about selling it. But I found so much cute kid stuff that I couldn't leave it. So there's kids, women's, men's, yeah. But I primarily sell on Poshmark. And hopefully with the new year, I say that every year, I'll, you know, venture out. But for now, Poshmark it is. All right, so let's just get started. All right, first thing I got is this kid's mustard pie, which reminds me of um, mud pie. Is that in like a knockoff line? How cute is this? Little dress, all these fun prints. It's gotta be like a knockoff or another version of mud pie. My daughters both used to wear mud pie. It's a size six, long sleeve, super cute. It's got a little bit of dingy around the sleeves, but I'll give it a wash and yeah. I think whatever this is, let me see. Just between friends, the JBF. So JBF, Ginger Marvin talks about the JBF cell. Um, they donated all their stuff to my bins. I don't know how it happened or when it happened, but it happened. <laughs> there was tons of stuff. So I picked, I picked up stuff. This is a little kids, little boys, babies, Nike fleece hat. What size are you? Toddler, it just says toddler. But just a little winter Nike hat, it's gray. So, I mean, this stuff weighs nothing. This is so precious. This has gotta be like vintage, way vintage. Didn't you wear one of these when you were a little kid? I know I wore a sailor dress when I was a little girl. This is, this. I feel like it has, it has shoulder pads, for sure. It's called The Children's Hour by Jan Briggs. The Children's Hour. I don't know comps on kids stuff, guys. I mean, it's not my, it's made in USA, 100% cotton, size five. Definitely vintage. It's like a corduroy. I mean, it's made of cotton, but it's corduroy pleated. Oh my gosh, like, this will sell. Based on nostalgia, nostalgia alone. Okay, it's all mixed in. So let me just pull out this other kids thing that I see. Well, there's so much. Um, I have never heard of this kid's brand, but it's Rachel Ashwell 4T. It just seemed like such high quality. It's I don't know if you can see if my lights are blowing it out, but it's a baby pink with like tan wooden buttons, an eyelet. Oh gosh, yeah, no, my my lights are totally blowing it out. But it's like the cutest little dress. It's so thick. It's got lots of layers. Yeah, just really high quality little dress. And the back is like a little, it V's and has buttons in the back too. Gosh, it's so cute. I just couldn't leave it there. All this kid stuff is so cute, I couldn't leave it there. Speaking of, let's look at this. Oh my gosh. This is Baby Bowden. Look at it. <laughs> How cute is that? It has that whale of a sail tag on there or whatever it's called. Baby Bowden is zero to three months. This is 100% lamb's wool. I mean, it is precious. 
It's a little zip up jacket and it's striped in the inside. So I got that and then I got this. Rare Editions was popular when my little kids were little. When my little kids were little, when my children were little. This is just a Rare Editions little jumper. It's like a corduroy, it's a Christmas. I need to list this like yesterday because it's time for Christmas pictures. It's 24 months. I got a couple little Christmas outfits. Here's another little kids thing. I know this is so like not like me. <laughs> I just couldn't say no. So this is called Flapjack Kids. So it's a little raccoon and then it's a hat and then it flapjacks into a fox. Hence the name. So I don't know. It's a two for one little hat. I got that. Okay. There's more kid stuff in here, but we'll get to it when we get to it. In the meantime, we're moving on. Um, this is just Lucky Brand, but size large and it's Lucky Brand at the bins. So we got it. It's a little wrap top, floral wrap top great bundle item I mean it'll probably sell for like $15 but when you pay 60 cents you get that or it's like a great item for me to put in my um, reseller boxes that I do my inventory purge boxes speaking of those are coming again soon so make sure you're following me on Instagram because I always announce over there when I'm about to drop boxes and I have so much stuff I need to drop boxes like a month ago uh, Lauren Ralph Lauren this is US size 18W, so it's plus size. This is such a cute bathing suit. It's dead of winter, but I pick up all seasons, all all things, all times. So it's a women's plus size bathing suit. Lauren Ralph Lauren. It's pink and orange. Has this little overlay, like chiffon overlay, and it's a one piece. And then like it ties in the front, adjustable straps, really like well-constructed bathing suit, padding, underwire, all the good things. So good size, cute. Oh, I found this bathing suit. I'm gonna keep this for myself, but it, it might be too big since I've lost weight, but I thought it was so cute. It's a large, it's just Morona, but I love a good stripe especially black and white. It has all these like different <laughs> ruching. So I'll try it on. If it's too big, I will sell it. Okay. I also got, I don't know, probably 15 things for my kids and for me that I've already taken out. Like these pajamas, hold on, I'll pull my leg up. <laughs> these little dog pajamas. Um, I got this pajama set at the bins on this day, but I took all that stuff out for me and my kids and washed it all. So this isn't all 68 pounds. There was more, but all right. These are Gap Kids Boyfriend Fit. The only reason I got this is because they're like brand new and they're flannel lined. So it, they're in perfect condition and they're lined with the flannel. So for winter, they're a US 12. My daughter is wearing like a 14 or like a 1-3 in juniors, so those are too small for her. Okay, I got this for the girl who goes to the gym. It's new a tag. Only reason I picked it up is because it literally probably costs 50 cents. Gym hair, don't care. Brand new a tag. It's unbranded. This is so soft what is this michael stars i think no staring at stars which is urban outfitters one size it's uh, a mohair blend it's just an infinity scarf see-through but like very furry so super soft cute oh gosh there went my hair Um, what are you? Oh, this is just an eyelet wrap dress. It's by Japna. I got this for my daughter as well, but she did not like how it looked. So now I'm stuck with it. 
and I hate, I really am picky about white, about things that are white when I list because I just hate listing, taking pictures of white on my white background. But it's like a 100% wrap dress, it's eyelet, it ruffles, it's 100% cotton. It's really good quality, it's in perfect condition. So, I don't know. I'll either put it in a box or I have no idea what I'm gonna do with it. Okay, and this, I think this is Aeropostale, no, this is Moon and Madison, which is just like a boutique brand sweater but i didn't care it's got a big cow neck it's cropped really really like chunky knit it's a little bit of a balloon sleeve but like this is a fun oversized boxy cropped sweater perfect for the season i love the color of it my back is already dying you guys the things i do for youtube <laughs> Um, this is a corset. It's brand new with tag. Flexies by Maiden Form. Yeah, new with tag. Just a corset. Nothing special, but it's brand new. How do I can't hardly leave brand new things there. Um, these are crew cuts, J. Crew, size 12. Maybe what I'll do. They're just a corduroy. Maybe I'll lock these and those gap jeans that are flannel line together. That might have a better luck of sailing. Sailing, wow. Sailing, take me away. <laughs> selling, selling. This is Kate Spade, uh, size medium. It's Kate Spade. My aunt met me at the bins this day. She pulled this out of the bins and was like, I found this Kate Spade, you want it? And I was like, yes, Aunt Mary, I do. Thank you. It's purple. Um, it's lined. It's perfect for a holiday party. Um, I don't like get super thrilled about Kate Spade because the clothes don't do as well, but that's fine. I'm excited about Kate Spade at the bins any day of the week. This is pink, size medium, Vic Victoria's, no, yeah, pink Victoria's Secret. Uh, this is a lilac hooded crop top. It's almost like a thermal, but not, oh, that was my phone, sorry. It's like open knit, like very open. You can see through it. So you need to wear a, a bralette underneath. I mean, I'm not trying to tell you what to do, but something might show if you don't. Okay, I'm gonna save that because I gotta find the blanket that goes with it. My back hurts. What have I done? Okay, this, oh, I'm old. <laughs> I'm riddled with arthritis, you guys. Um, old Navy XXL, that's why I got this. And then you'll see I got another one too. This is so cute. And Old Navy plus size and cute like this, I will definitely pick that up at the bins. And they wanted what, $6.99 for this at Goodwill? They didn't sell there. It's in excellent condition, but it's like this chambray. So two size 2X. It's hard to show you the whole thing because I'm sitting down. Wide leg cropped jumpsuit, like romper. Oh gosh, it's so cute. So. And then in the back, it's smocked, so. It's just that lyocell tinsel material. Crop length, super wide leg, cute. And then I found another one. You guys, I have to readjust myself. Like, there's no way that I'm gonna be able to do this. Uno Memento. It's really trying to have it be so cute. It's really trying to have the, the cute background that I forgot about my aching body. So we'll see how long I can make it. Okay, next thing is just False Creek, which is what, Target? I have no idea, but it's a, it was a 1X, and it's so it's a cute, like, right? It's a cute. It's a little green lyocell button front paper bag waist skirt with a tie, and it was size 1X. I mean, I could, 
definitely get $15 for it. So I grabbed it. And I'm in the living room, which means you will hear the noise of a full house. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, this is Out From Under, which is Urban Outfitters. This is size large. It's teeny weeny, itty bitty. But it's like a cropped, a ribbed cropped top, crop, top, undershirt, bralette type of thing. It's in this really cute green. Perfect for Christmas right now, you know, for a teen. Wear that underneath a little, a little open front Christmas card again. Cute. Oh, this. Okay, this is Jimboree. This is size four. It's a nightgown and it's gingerbread. How cute is this for the little tiny baby? Well, not baby, toddler. Size four. Oh, it's a long red gingerbread nightgown. Oh, good grief. Makes me want to have a baby. Too bad I don't have any organs. <laughs> okay. This one. So this is the other Old Navy. This one is just an extra large, but this one is brand new with tags. So the other one was a 2XL. This one is an extra large, and it's like a dark chambray. But this is a maxi dress, and it's so it's like a fake denim chambray, and it's tiered. It's a tiered maxi dress, full length, obviously, if it's a maxi dress. Adjustable straps, like it is just so cute. So, brand new. Can't say no. And this is also, I'm not going to say cute, <laughs> because I've said that 8,000 times. Um, just a heads up, like when I go to my thrift store and have to pay two, three, four, five dollars, I say two because a lot of times I get things half off. Um, these, like I wouldn't pick up exhilaration or that kind of stuff and pay up for it, but when, like, when you're growing by weight and this is not a pound, so it's like a buck. This is, um... Exhilaration, but it's an extra large. It's a jumper. It's corduroy. And it's floral. It has pockets. Um, and it has that cute little tie across there. I was hoping my kid would like this, my oldest daughter. She hasn't seen it yet, so she still might like it. I don't know. But let me tell you something about Target brands. If it's cute, it'll it'll sell. Uh, if it's new with tag in Target, like Wild Fable, like cute. I just sold a plaid baby doll dress. It was new with tag. It retailed for $14.99, and I sold it for $22, $21.99. It was an extra large. It was new with tags. So I sold it for more than it retailed for on Posh. I did. So, okay, this is so cute. I don't know what this is but I must have picked it up just because of this print and because of how soft it was. So it's like this bo boho print with a blanket scarf. Must be, it doesn't have a brand. <laughs> Maybe I was using this as a cart cover. I don't know. Regardless, it's super cute, super big and very bohemian, so it will sell. Oh wait, it does have a brand. Well, it doesn't have a brand, but it has an RN number and I will look it up. It's just acrylic. Maybe it's something good, like Ralph Lauren. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, guys. Okay, again, another thing that's going to be really hard to show. But it's just this tie around the neck. And then it ties inside of here. And goes in the back and like has that drop waist so it like laces up the back that's way too hard to show you it's a maxi it's like a bandana handkerchief print floral maxi dress super boho really cute for summer it's just forever 21 but it was probably a dollar 29 so great bundle items um 
Okay. This was so cute. I loved it so much. Didn't have a brand, but I'm going to... Hold on a second. No brand, but I picked it up based on style. It's probably a boutique E brand. Or it could be something really good and just don't have any tags. I don't know. I'll use Google Image. See how it's all like mesh or lace and then it has this fun neck. And then it has like tulle over these really roughly pleated Victorian looking sleeves. Oh my gosh, that is precious. And it's definitely plus size or at least an extra large. It's like maroon and a deep, deep blue. It is just adorable. I think it had a size. Yep, it does. Oh, and it's new. So see, it has an extra mother of pearl button here. It's a, oh, it's a medium. <laughs> okay, this is way bigger than a medium. Maybe it's just meant to be like really oversized. Maybe I should wear this in a video. Well, I'll try that on. But I picked it up because of the style. Okay, and this is altered state. You guys, I have an issue. I say it every time. This is medium as well. I can't say no to altered state because it's the style every time gets me. It only sells for 17 to 22, sometimes 25 dollars but look at this this is smocked with these little sleeves it's like a nude tan little baby doll dress with the lace at the bottom freaking altered state is so cute their stuff is so cute <sighs> i can't say no this is alter also altered state i think i found like three pieces all together this is a large Um, it's green, olive green, it's cropped, it's got these giant sleeve, sleeves, my gosh, I can't talk today. All this extra fabric, it's like a gauzy, how can I describe that? It's just a gauzy mess. <laughs> Ruffled, just really bohemian, the best way. I'm not doing that great with brands, am I, guys? I'm sorry. It's a bread and butter haul. This is a bread and butter bins haul. This is the kind of stuff I pick up at my bins here in Indianapolis. Uh, if I lived somewhere cool, it'd probably be better. Okay, I picked these up based on style because there is no brand, but look at these pants. High waist, paper bag. Do they have pockets? They do. Pockets, wide leg, animal print. They're probably like sheen. And I'm not even kidding when I say that. I feel like this would be a sheen thing. There's no size. I don't see a brand. I feel like it's missing a belt. Has belt loops. Hold on. Is it sheen? Brown. Medium. No. It has R beef. So it has a number. And they're a medium. So at least I know what size they are. Gosh. I might wear these high waist with like a turtleneck and like a cardigan and then list them or I might love them and never list them who knows this is free people um free people size medium this this label is can you see it look how old this free people label is or maybe it's a new label I have no idea but this was really cute and I wasn't leaving it behind Hold on, I'm gonna button it so you can see it. It's cream. It's a, like a midi length skirt. Buttons all the way down, raw edges. Yeah, gosh, it's so cute. All these different like textures. You probably can't even see it because it has these lights, sorry. I'll do better next time, I promise. What are you? Oh, these are Prana. Not to be confused with Prada. <laughs> Prana. Little leggings. They're black, they're cropped. It's a good outdoor brand. 
I usually will always pick up piranha at the bins. Well, shoot, who am I kidding? I mean, I'm not very picky at the bins. These are J. Crew. Gosh, I love these as well. Size 12. So these would be too big. But these are a tr like a stretch. I wish they had a name on them. That would be wonderful. They're just a navy trouser. Like a tapered leg, paper bag, kinda. I don't know, stretch. I could see through them, so better wear dark underwear. But they have pockets. I don't know, they're just like a. I, they're J. Crew, so I know they have a style name. I just don't know where it is. Is this the other. Yeah, I think. Yep. This is the other altered state piece. It's a size medium, it's plaid. It's like a little jumper dress yep I had to get that has the little keyhole in the back just on style alone it was coming home with me this is really fun this is vintage styled by um, Armenia styled by Armenia I think that's what that says made in USA this is fun. So someone left their little vintage brooch on there, which is totally fine. It's a pin. I'll just take that off. Look how fun this is. That's a blazer, like a blazer coat in this really fun plaid. It's definitely wool. I don't know if it has, I don't think, does that have pockets? It does, look. See the pockets? And then it buttons how many times in the front? So one, just a single button. Nope, yep, one. One button and there's an extra on the inside. Gosh, that's adorable. And it's a big size, I think. Well, I said that last time and it wasn't. So let me check. It doesn't have a size. We'll see, my foot is numb. Ugh. Oh gosh, could you imagine if I accidentally brought, brought down the whole Christmas tree? <laughs> yeah, that's Harry and Marv, wet bandits. I wore this shirt last Christmas too. I found this coach. <laughs> um, dust bag no coach purse to go with it but I sell coach purses so whenever I get one or sell one now I can put it in the dust bag this is laundry by Shelly Seagal this brand is expensive but it doesn't always resell for the most but I thought since it's a holiday coming up this is like the perfect dress. So this is the neck right here. High neck, cold shoulder, big poof sleeve, and then it's cuffed at the bottom. It's like burgundy velvet, little shift dress. It's really cute, it's a, like a mini dress. It needs one heck of a lint roll, but so cute for the holiday. The only thing is it's, you know, that hook and loop, hook and eye closure. It, it has one, but the other one, it's like it has the hook, but not the eye. But I have a million of those. I just can't sew. I mean, I can, but I just won't. <laughs> so I'm gonna, I'll just list it and then say, I'll include the little hooky thingy, but you have to sew it on there yourself. I've done that before with a pair of pants that had the same problem and they were like, sure, no problem. That takes two seconds and I'm like, better you than me. <laughs> okay, this is the brand with the three stripes. This is Adidas, this is li a lilac, really heavy. This is, I feel like this is a special Adidas shirt. It's a um, extra large. It says the brand with the three stripes. This is like, doesn't seem like a normal, it's not a, like a normal t-shirt. It's very thick. It's like a spirit jersey type thickness. Boxy. It's lilac color with the black. Three stripes. Okay, what is this? Oh, this is just Ann Taylor. But it's Ann Taylor, not Loft. It's Ann Taylor. And it's uh, extra large. And it's blush. And it's a textured. Ooh, is that a bug? Oh my god. It is. Look, a roly poly. <gasps> oh god. 
it's dead don't worry Whew. so I haven't taken this stuff out or washed or done anything yet guys it's just been sitting here since last week anyone know something else that's hilarious I have another bins haul that I did before this one that's been sitting down in my basement for two and a half months that's the dogs in case you were wondering so I need to film that one and get that one up but the struggle is real the struggle is real and none of this is listed because I'm a terrible reseller Banana Republic these are the Ryan fit so cute these are so cute hold on let me button them I'm not a terrible reseller guys but I'm part-time and when I say I'm part-time I mean I'm part-time <laughs> it takes everything that I have to list I don't know if I work hard I can get like 60 listings up in a weekend but then that's it I don't list anything for weeks after that I should just do like two or three or five a day but I work in bulk I batch work that's like the best way for me to do things take 100 pictures that usually lasts me like two weeks not 100 pictures but 100 a picture of 100 items I'll spend a whole day doing pictures and you know take photograph 100 to 150 things and then like then I have pictures and I can edit them and then draft them 50 drafts at a time I could usually list all those things in like two days listings are really fast for me on Poshmark it's just boom 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 but um yeah but it takes everything I have to list consistently to even turn on my computer for my bot to share my class <laughs> and to send out offers and then shipping I still am making sell sales daily without listing. I think it's because my thing sends out offers, so I don't know. And then like filming hauls and like, like I am just, and then working and then kids and then the house, all the things. It's all the things. I'm just not, I am part time. And I say that with the greatest sincerity. I do so much. <laughs> and so yeah, I'm, I'm not a terrible reseller. I just am a, true part-time reseller and I I just don't it's not listed yet that's the moral of the story it'll be trickling in but it but it takes me a while and then every time I'm like well I'm gonna have everything listed before I film the haul then the haul never comes so I just need to stick to what I know film it <laughs> and then process it okay banana republic Ryan fit these are the Ryan fit they're like a they're linen they're navy blue almost like a cargo with the tie waist we got pockets banana republic I'm not like super hyped that it's banana republic but I, I mean it's linen they're they're a size 8 they're in great condition my dog he's so confused because all the Christmas stuff is up so he's like where do I go where do I go um, kimchi blue, size medium. This is Urban Outfitters. It is a plaid little peplum blazer. It just has three buttons in the front. Don't growl at each other, that's hateful. And it peplums out. Very cute. Very clueless. Y2K. Super cute. Okay, this is a shacket. It's American Eagle. This is a heavy, heavy, heavy flannel. Like super heavy. Almost like a shacket. No, it's really it's just a flannel. It doesn't have buttons. I mean it has buttons, but not like snaps, so. It's a purple and gray and green flannel from American Eagle. This is Logo by Lori Goldstein. This has to go in the wash. The sad thing is, is I'm pretty sure this is new without tags. It's an extra large. It has the barb still in it. And I feel like that's a newer logo tag, but someone tried it on and had, I don't know what they had on themselves or what they had on their face or what. But I think it's deodorant. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's deodorant. I don't want to smell it. I don't want to touch it. 
I'm gonna wash it because this is such a good size, number one, it's an extra large, but this is so cute. It's got like these sleeves are a little bit poofed and they're fitted down here, but like the hem on this, shark bite, it's a tunic, tunic length, can you see it all? You know, it's flowy, it smells like, it smells clean. I think someone just got their suave deodorant all over it. So, okay. So I feel like we're getting into some good stuff. If you're still here, I'm thrilled. My battery is dead? Are you kidding me? I'll be right back. Okay. We're back. We are back with a new battery. These batteries die so fast. I love this camera because I love the picture, but I hate the battery life. Sony, get it together. Okay, this is vintage. What? Oh my gosh, I love this skirt. Ori made in Italy, original Venetia sportswear. See so yeah. it? Oh my gosh, this skirt, you guys, is everything. It's just like a high-waisted, pleated, purple midi skirt. It's wool. I love it. I absolutely love it. It's a 10-12. I think it's more like, like a medium. It's stuff. It's it's stretchy, and the crazy thing is, is it's still like you know, it doesn't have. It's in perfect condition, and it doesn't have any of that weird rotting in the elastic. Oh, this was a good good find. These are brand new with tag. I mean, the tag has been through it, but they're torrid. Brand new with tag, torrid denim. Size 18. And these are called, well, they don't say. I thought they said, they do. They're called a the stiletto ankle zip. They're in a lavender color or lilac, size 18. They get a zipper on the ankle. Yeah, I'm excited about those. Brand new tag toward at the bins. Yep. Oh, this is, I think, Lucky Brand. I feel like I found like three. Oh, I've got the hiccups, I'm sorry. Yep, Lucky Brand, is it silk? There's no freaking size. Of course there's not. There's no size, this feels like silk. Might not be. I would say that it's like probably a medium, maybe a large, not 100% not sure, and not sure which side is the front and which side is the back. This one is like a V-neck and the other is like a round. So I'm not really sure which way it goes, but it's a really cute pattern. Lucky brand. Okay, I got a couple scarves. Well, I've shown you a couple scarves. This one is, um, oh, what's that one that's like not real cashmere, but it feels like it? This one, cashmink. Cashmink, this is so soft. Feels just like cashmere. It's like a fake cashmere. It's just black and gray. With fringe. This is a big, huge, it's called Cashmere Touch, made in Korea. It's houndstooth, it's black and white. It's a poncho. It's a poncho cape. See? These do so good, these kinds of things. Every woman loves a good poncho. Huh, Tata? <laughs> ah, okay, this is Vineyard Vines. I should have started with this bag. This bag has got the good stuff in it. Darn it, I hope you guys are all still here. Vineyard Vines, women size four, pinstripe, blue and white with the hot pink edging. I'm hoping that my kid just stays like a size one to three, and she can wear that on our cruise in, in the coming April. Style & Co size large, I got this for myself because I love thermal, like waffle knit. I have one in um, like a tan color for American Eagle, and this one is cream and it has the tie front. These are like my favorite kinds of shirts to wear with leggings around the house, love them so much. Okay, this is a fun bra. Look at this. That's see-through. And it's like caged. Ooh, ooh. Ooh la la. 
It's Kashik. Kashik. I can't say that. 40 double D. Kashik. Every time I think of Kashik, I think Kashik. Kashik. I think of Kasa Chic on Instagram. <laughs> and our tips of the day. Anyways. Uh, yeah. It's leopard print on the bands. Let's, this is like perfect condition. Underwire. That is a smexy bra. Here is a miracle suit. I always pick up miracle suits. I don't even care really what they look like, just as long as they're in good shape. It's an easy $25. If it's really cute, they can do much better than that. This is size 10. This is just plain. Lots of ruching. These make you look 10 pounds smaller. Guaranteed. Well, I don't really know if it's guaranteed, but I should work. I, I should do an infomercial for them. This is J. Crew. Size small. Can you see? My nails look ratchet. Don't. No. Don't come for me. It's oh, it's a perfect winter sweater by J. Crew. It needs just a little bit of a sweater shave, but overall, it's in really, really good condition. I'm pretty sure it's size small. Gosh, now that I'm in here under all these weird lights, I'm like, am I sure? All right, let me show you this baby blanket really quick. So this is like a granny crochet baby blanket, pink, blue, white chevron. This thing is impeccable. It's big. Really big. Really beautiful. Someone did a really good job on this. Like, they're really excellent at doing that. What's it called? Crochet. <laughs> and look at this. Oh my gosh. So I was like, I'm going to sell them together. Look at the buttons on this. Come on, camera. You see those buttons? They're like flower and like mother of pearl looking. Someone made this. It's a two button little hooded. I feel like it's like Angora or something. It's not real Angora, but like, or, you know, it's very soft and cozy. And someone wants to buy this for a baby that's coming. Oh, it's so cute. Speaking of Angora, this is Angora. My kid was so mad because I wouldn't give it to her. I'm like, that's a 100% French Angora hat. You're not keeping that. Sorry, kid. Your mom's a reseller. What are you thinking here? It did look really cute on her. This is 100% French Angora. <laughs> oh, this is how it goes. I think it just goes on, you know. How do I, does that look cute? All right, next. Oh. This, yeah, so I'm listing this for sure. Like, this will sell. It's it's the softest, most precious thing ever. Pier 1, it's brand new. It's a little heart. It says it's an all-purpose wrap, and it's a heart, white and red. That's my dogs. Sorry. Um, yeah, you can decorate, tablecloth, whatever you choose. This is Pendleton. Don't you feel sorry for all the people who left because they thought my haul was terrible? It got better. This is a camel blazer, women's. Just cl classic wool Pendleton blazer. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. I thought it was missing a button. It's not. It's only supposed to have one, right? No. It's supposed to have two. I can't tell. It is. No, it isn't. I'm so confused, you guys. No, it's not. Or if it was, they took it off. It has one button. It just has one button. But I also think I see a little, looks like a little, it's a freaking hole from a moth. <laughs> oh well, it's okay. It's all right. Okay, I need your help. I think that this is something good. You see that? Imperci Mauve. And this is the brand. <laughs> Roan. Watch these come from Amazon. I would die. I'll die. But I feel like these were something good. They feel very nice. They have like these three X's here. Roan. Oh, did I just lose my Angora? They're definitely men's and they were written in another language. Size 32. Oh no, created in the USA. Mm -mm. 
Quit barking at each, like do you hear them growling at each other? You guys, I have 15 minutes left on this memory card. I have got to hustle. Okay, this is Daniel, Danielle, Blasi, Blasi, made in Italy. See that? It's got this shearling. It's a men's cardigan. It's gray or taupe. And then it has this button down it. Isn't that lovely? It's definitely lovely. It's a size. No idea. It's a size. It's wool and acrylic. And I don't know a size. Gosh darn it. How comes I keep finding? What is this? I feel like I'm a thread up. Can't find a size on anything. Oh, it's a large. Yes. Men's large. Really nice uh, sweater. I just sold a um, something Uomo made in Italy sweater for 50 bucks on Posh. I've been selling lots of men's things on Posh lately. This is Denim and Flower Ricky Sing Sin Flannel. 100% cotton, size medium. I feel like I'm getting this confused with Denim and Supply by Ralph Lauren. <laughs> this is probably sold at TJ Maxx. But I don't know. I'll look it up. But it, regardless, it's a perfect holiday play on because of the color. This is precious. This is definitely, I think, handmade or a boutique type how cute that is it's a top I know it looks like a dress but it's not it's a little girl's smocked little pleated oh my gosh look at these pleats and the ruffle because it's a size I think it's a six it definitely is not a size six in real life I think it's a vintage yeah size six that's all it says no brand but it's definitely very cottage core prairie oh my god my leg is asleep my leg is asleep I am all aboard the Hot Mess Express. True, true. Right here. Um, this is Baby Gap, toddler two years. It's new with tags. It's a wool blend. Little dress. It's lined. Oh my God, I've got to hustle. I have got to hustle. It's lined. It's definitely wool. I can feel it. Wool. 9% wool. Poly acrylic and wool. You can feel the wool. Okay, these are Massimo High Rise Short. These are for me. I got these. We're going on a cruise in April, so if I can find anything that's going to fit me, or that will hopefully fit me by then. This is really sexy lingerie here. And this is called, like, what lingerie? Real lingerie for everybody. Size 3X, 4X. Isn't that amazing? It's for everybody. Like everybody, get it? 3X, 4X. Love finding plus size stuff like that. That's like brand new condition. This is BG, B. <laughs> this is BCBG Max Azria, or Max Azria, however you want to say it. It's a size four. Okay. It looks a mess right now, but it's gold, like a really gold dress, and it's 100% silk, and it's a shift dress, and it has pockets. And I think that once I steam this, this would be like such a good dress. It's lined. Such a good dress for New Year's. It's like a very... Oh, here's another fun lingerie. Um, this is new with tag. I would never pick up underwear at the bins that weren't new with tag. Um, this is Cacique again. And this is size... 1820. These are 40 seriously sexy collection by Cacique. These are $40 underwear, you guys. So that's the back. You can see the little, it has a, such cute little lace and a bow and all the things. <sighs> there it is. Uh, so yeah, of course I got that. This is another, this is plus size, lands in. This is 1820. Lands in. Bathing suit. It's it's got padding. It's got the little thing. What's that called? 
the covering over the, you know, I don't know what I'm trying to say. I'm half brain dead at this point. This is Gap, 100% cotton. I love this. It's like a military green utility jacket. These big heavy things up here. Zips up, buttons up, size small. That's a, that's like an everyday basic piece piece from Gap, like in a, a closet essential, in the words of Mike Thursley. <laughs> okay, this is Weatherproof Vintage, size small. This is a sweater. It's like cinnamon, cinnamon rust color. I got it because of these sleeves. Look at these sleeves. They're ruched. Oh my gosh, these sleeves are amazing. So, oh, and it's ruched up the side too. Okay, next, Hudson, size 30. Does anyone still sell Hudson jeans? <laughs> uh, they're size 30, they're like a gray wash jean. Look like a tapered or straight leg. Here's a John Deere hat for little babies. It says John Deere on the back too. It is size One size, it's definitely toddler though, so that's what I'll put in the listing. I think this is another Lucky Brand. Yeah, I remember finding all those Lucky Brand in the same bin. This one is a 2X though. It's purple, paisley. It's just a T. Oh, it, oh, it slits up the back. I didn't know that. So, okay, we are almost done. Oh gosh. These jeans are so cute. These are so cute. These are logo Lori Goldstein. These are called the Flare. They're a size 12 in women's. Logo Lori Goldstein. I've never found her jeans, but I was so excited to find these. These are pinstriped, flared. I don't know. I don't know if they're cropped. I don't think so. I just think they're flared and they have like the engineer pinstripe in them. Dear God, adorable. I'm excited to look those up because, you know, and they're such a great size. This is Matilda Jane, women's, size small. It's just like a, see all that embroidery and lace? I do okay with women's Matilda Jane. It's like a blush pink little tee. This is Billabong. And it is, oh my gosh, it is this. It's a Billabong dress. It's a maxi wrap dress. Oh no, it's a midi. It's a midi wrap dress. I can't show you how cute it truly is because my arms don't do that. But if you wanna see what anything looks like, when I get them listed, you can, I, link my, I will link my Poshmark closet and then you can see how I take pictures and stuff. This is just a little champion brawl. I got this for my daughter and she said, ew, and that's ugly. And I was like, well, it's getting me. All right, last item. Thank God. I'm so excited to get off this floor. <sighs> okay, this is vintage, I think, too. Okay, made in France for Harriet Cassman, Washington, D.C. Like, I want, was she like somebody in the government? Made in France for Harriet Cassman. Maybe I should look her up. This is a Dana Cote Desert, made in France. I don't know. It sounded expensive and it was so cute. Has shoulder pads. It's a size 42. It's a blazer, shoulder plaid, shoulder plaid. Shoulder pads, which I don't know if you can take those out. Nope, you sure can't. Ooh, unless you cut into it, then you could. But they're built in shoulder pads but it's houndstooth and it's purple. Purple and black houndstooth. Long line, it's definitely wool. It was made in France. 60%, oh my gosh, it's wool, 60% wool, 40% cashmere. You guys, this might be the piece. Did I save the best for last? I think I saved the best piece for last. 
I think this was someone famous's blazer. <laughs> or I think now I'm just making things up. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in my next one. Bye. That is it. I'm done. Thank goodness. I really like this hat.